Hey guys, it's Mr. Joshua again, and today we are doing another custom Gundam MSIA reveal. And today we are reviewing a custom Battle Scarred Shinlong Gundam. This is a custom of mine that I did a while back ago, about, about a year and a half or so. I did this guy around Christmas time, so yeah, I, had some, I actually had some time to get, you know, Battle Scarred, so this is the first one that I did in a while. But let's get down to the review. This is a custom Battle Scarred Shinlong. It's a version one, so all his joints are the same. There's nothing different. There's nothing different between him and the original Shinlong. Other than the fact that this dude is Battle Scarred. Uh, he's got a nice little arm that extends, which is pretty sweet. He's missing the hand in, uh, the uh, hand in there right now. I couldn't find it. But I gave him, you know, heavily damaged Battle Scar damage on him. I try to. You know, bases damage off of what I could see on the uh, unofficial Bandai release, uh, unreleased that uh, never you know came to be. Uh, his shield is pretty screwed up too. He's got some explosion marks, bullet holes, a little bit of burn marks and whatnot. Now this guy just looks like he's been through hell and back. You know, he's truly a badass. I mean, check out his little uh, dragon arm that I did. It's pretty cool. I'm not sure if you see the details, but you know, there he is. Um, I actually did two of these guys. This is that was this is the first one I did, and here's the uh, second one. I just couldn't find it. Just you know, shield as of you know now, so I just figured I'd grab them and show you guys real quick. But yeah, this is um, actually a pretty big comparison. This is the first one. This is the second one I did later on. Now with the second one, I actually did my own. I actually you know, made up my own battle scarring on him. I wanted to do another version of him where he wasn't, you know, so fucked up. But uh, they're both equally cool. My favorite one in particular is the first one. He's just, he, he's just awesome. He's he's just really awesome. Sorry, but uh, let's see. He's got some bullet holes, explosion, some gashes. Now his feet have really good detail. Now this guy is just a straight up badass too. They're, they're, they're both badasses. <laughs> and uh, they're both going to be up on my eBay store pretty soon for sale. Uh, this one's going to be a loner for sale. And uh, this guy right here, he's going to be in a lot of five uh, Gundam Wing action figures. I actually had a whole entire set of uh, Gundam Wing Battle Scarred. Not the Endless Waltz edition, just my, my own custom. Uh, customs that I did. Uh, I, I just really wanted the original all five, you know, Gundams from the uh, Gundam Wing series to be battle scarred, and unfortunately, they never released it. Well, they, well, they did for the Endless Waltz version, but not just for the you know regular ones. So I brought it upon myself to make my own, and uh, so far so good. They all came out pretty good. Um, I'm actually having a tough time trying to figure out which one looks the best. Now, if you guys could help me out there, you know, just let me know on the uh, comment section. Now, just tell me which one you guys like the more, uh, li li like the best. You know, the guy on the left, you know, or the guy on the right. Pretty awesome. Well, anyways, thanks for enjoying my Gundam MSIA review. And if you guys want to see more, just you know, give me a heads up, comment in the section below, like my like my videos and whatnot, and. Stay tuned for some more custom Gundam MSA figures. Thanks.